Welcome to the Outdoor Travel Channel with Robin Jury. Well, after five and a half hours of driving up to Page, Arizona, it was time to launch the boat at Lake Powell. But before we do that, we have to do the dreaded thing, put gas in it. So the bad part about this trip is we probably put $120 or so in the tank. Then we gotta spend $80 for a National Park sticker. So we'll be dropping about $250 in the next hour. Alrighty, so our grand total is $152.34. Dang. I think we have a 120 gallon tank, so we only need 58 gallons. Huh. That means I've been carrying around like 60 gallons. Alright, here's my grand total. So guys, we're here at Lake Powell. And uh, just to let you know uh, what it's like to have a boat here, and as a, I have an excited dog, is when you get uh, in here, we have to get an annual pass for Glen Canyon, which is this little bugger right here. So that costs between that and have a pass on your boat, which is the sticker you put on the side of your boat, um, we spent $100 for the whole thing. I'm not sure what costs what, but so... <laughs> Right after getting fuel of 150 bucks, <laughs> we just dropped another hundred, but that's part of the game. But anyway, so we're gonna get the boat ready and we're gonna launch it here pretty quick. So, uh, right here, we this is the overflow area, and this is a chance for us to put our ropes on, put our buoys on, and just little things that we need to have ready to put the boat in the water. So, here we are getting ready to put things on. Pretty day, excited to see if the boat still floats. So off to the boat launch we went with anticipation of hitting the water and having a great time. So we backed her on up and we'll show you the process of how we do this. And Sherry gets out and kind of directs me and then I take it from there. So here we go, launching the boat. The boat gets launched, but soon we will have a little bit of a problem. Well, really, a big problem. Well, good morning, everybody. So, a little humble pie here. So last night you saw us launch the boat, and that's as far as we got. So uh, we had trouble with uh, getting the engine started, and our batteries are dead. So we spent the night at the dock here, <laughs> the launch facility. So, kind of a rough night. So, uh, we actually met a guy. I'm going to actually get the batteries switched out. And so I got four batteries coming and I'm going to have the guy switch out our batteries. And hopefully we can get off the, uh, the, the launch ramp here and actually move over to the area that we're going to be staying. So, yeah. <laughs> and it was really hot inside. Yeah, plus it was hot in here so it was hard to sleep. So, kind of a rough night. But, I don't know, that's part of the adventure. So we're officially getting our batteries put in. Well, we got one engine running and it turns out we have a bad starter. So I have a guy coming in. I have an extra starter in the boat. So we're going to have that switched out today. Got new batteries. So I'll probably be dropping $500 today. Oh well, that's boating for you. Anyway, we are in our... Uh, space now over here in the uh, marina you can kind of see around so 
So since the day didn't turn out the way we expected, uh, we still got to stop at the office, finish our registration. Uh, we haven't ate very well, so we're going to go grab something to eat. And uh, trying to make uh, uh, lemonade out of all these lemons. So, hey, those things happen. So, interesting weekend, but uh, so yeah, I'll probably give you some pictures of the guy working on the engine. And uh, we'll go from there. Make sure we get everything running. All systems are back up and running, except one engine. And uh, we'll be back to normal. Well, we might be dead in the water, but we still have our swim step. So this is Cinder's time to go swimming. You want to have her to go to the dock? Yeah. All right, we're going to have her go off the dock. There, but Good job, dog. so anyway, come on. Guess she's going swimming again. Thought we'd take the time to show you how you get around in this marina. Well, they use little carts, and let's go for a ride. Time for a little evening sunset magic. Well, this is Sunday and we are wrapping up our trip. We still have an engine down, we got to change the starter. So next time we come up, it may be changed or I'll change it when I get up there. So if you look behind the truck, See, we got our trailer, we're taking that back home, and uh, we'll squeeze that inside of the house, which is a lot easier when the boat's not on it. So, we're on our way home, you probably can hardly hear me, but we're in the middle of a monsoon. And, uh, let's take a little peek here. Oh, God. So, everybody's pulling over on the side of the road. starting to slow down but what I was pretty exciting <laughs> it's so loud. they were so loud you couldn't hear anything anyway I'll let you peek outside one more time well we made it home got the trailer put away you can see the truck right there over the fence and there's the trailer uh, actually it was easier to put in when I had the boat Anyway, we're home. Even though we had some lumps and bumps along the way, we had a wonderful weekend with Cinder swimming and we had some great meals and got to enjoy some beautiful sunsets. So yeah, it was a good trip. But next time, we're going to get that boat running.
Hey, thanks for watching our video to Lake Powell. Our first week was a little rough, but the ones in the future will be better. Please take the time to subscribe and share our videos. Thanks guys, bye.